Thirty minutes after they left the conference center full of PD officers from around the country, Mitchell Gaines spotted the change in his dog. He and his canine partner, Saxon, had already walked nearly three miles, trying to burn off the long training day. Being out in the woods alone and working was one thing. But an all-day focus during seminars and demonstrations meant they needed the quiet of the dark beach. Waves crashed onto the shore. The sea breeze had a bite to it that cut through Mitchell's jacket and numbed his ears. Saxon didn't care. The German shepherd loved cool temps. Until he shifted, his ears back. His pace changed, and he started to break out of the heel in a way that meant only one thing. He'd picked up a scent. Saxon's training allowed him to pick people out in locations, hidden victims, hiding suspects. If there was a person to find, he knew where they were. What you got, Sax? Mitchell kept his tone high. They kept walking. Waves crashed, and one particularly eager one got Sax's paws wet. The next one only made half the distance. Saxon slowed, scenting the ocean with sucks of those nostrils. His body tense, and his ears pricked. Who's out there? The dog could have a scent from a distance on the breeze. But Mitchell didn't see a boat anywhere. The ocean was dark, with no lights out on the horizon except for a container ship in the distance. Too far. Mitchell turned, about to call Saxon to turn back to the conference center, when he saw it. A flash in the moonlight off the tip of a wave. Red. Or a color that looked like it. Then the ocean surged with the roll of a wave. What is? The surface dipped. An inflatable dinghy hit the top of the next wave and flipped over. A person, small enough to be a kid, flung out. The child hit the water with a splash. Saxon barked. Mitchell dropped the leash. Stay. He raced to the ocean and waded in. The water slowed his progress, but the kid hadn't sunk. He floated face down on the surface where he'd landed. Mitchell's heart felt like it was in his throat. The water was instantly numbing in a way he could fight, but which Saxon wouldn't be so quick to shake off. A kid? The dog would save the child with no care for his own health. 